guys, what's up? Gimli1357 here, and I'm doing an achievement guide in Worms Ultimate Mayhem for the achievement exceptional to find all the hidden Easter eggs in the game. Um, this is all the Easter eggs in the Worms 4 Mayhem storyline, not the Worms 3D ones. Those ones, you don't have to get those. So we're just going to go straight to story and pick up our little gamer's guide people that we did. And we're going to find the first Easter egg on Destruct and Serve, the fifth uh, mission. And so, here we are, looking at the description, and click. And here we go, past the loading screen. So first thing you're going to do, you're going to spawn up on top of that little truck thingy. So you're going to come over here and, hey, what's that look like? If any of you have seen this movie, and you better have seen this movie, if you haven't seen this movie, go see this movie right now. But it kind of looks like a DeLorean, doesn't it? Like a, a certain special DeLorean that looks kind of, kind of like a movie called Back to the Future, if you've ever heard of that, which you better have, and the wire hanging above it, just like that. So what you gotta do is blow it up. You don't have to use dynamite, but I like using dynamite because that's the best thing to blow stuff up with. And when the dynamite goes off, you'll see a little cutscene of flames shooting out the back. Just like it went back to the future. And so, here we are, finish that, that's your one easter egg, now we're at Nice to Seed You, the tenth mission. And here, first thing you want to do is worm select, or you can, like, crawl around the back if you don't want to hurt your worm to get back here. I just took the quickest route, and that's to get your worm that's on top of the base, and just jump down. Yeah, so you jump down there, he'll get hurt, but don't worry about it, because it doesn't kill him. And you can go around this, like I said, without getting hurt, but it's easier. And then, when it's your next turn, just so you can see there, I was kind of confused on which worm I had selected. So I go back to him, and then back to him. And so you want to go into this little secret cave that's hidden back here, and we will see a little another cutscene that has a worm bunny with weird glasses and rings. But he's like, ah! He's like, no. And you can just come up here and he's gone. But there's a little candle. And now we're going to go to Tin Can Wally. Um, and the first thing you're going to do, this is my favorite mission, by the way. First thing you're going to do is turn around and you'll see an outhouse over there with a toilet. Shoot the toilet with a shotgun or sniper rifle. Just shoot it and ba boom The screen will shake and poison will go everywhere and I'll say you found an Easter egg. So, that's the other one. I do my cool little spin there. Now we go to Carpet Cappers. Or Capers. Carpet Capers, I don't know. The 18th mission. And so you'll see you'll spawn up here and so what you want to do is look around the towers you'll see all the different enemy worms. And notice the one named Egg. Hmm. That could be a small hint, don't you think? Kind of a hint there. So get the parachute ready. Don't equip it, though. Just get it, like, so your selection bar is right on top of it. And then jump. And then pull it up, and boom. That way you fall down a good distance. And you can see I actually did not fall down enough. So what you can do is actually, if you select it again, you'll drop and then pull it out again. So you come down here, and there's some gems. Pick those up, and you found an Easter egg. The third one. No, fourth one. Fourth one. Third one. Fourth one, yes. So this is the fifth one. Escape from Tree Rex. Uh, the 22nd mission. This is the last Easter egg in the game. And so what you have to do is... Uh, I like using the jetpack just because it's quicker. For this part, I did use the parachute just to get the time trial thingy done, but it's quicker to use the jetpack. And then just pull out your bazooka and aim at the T Rex and aim right for his mouth. Gotta hit him square in the mouth. And kaboom! You found an Easter egg to feed the T Rex. And bleep, bloop, Avatar Award unlocked. We got the Worm T shirt. Which is to find the Easter eggs. And we also get our achievement, Exceptional, for 15 gamer score. 
So guys, I hope you enjoyed the achievement guide, and I hope you will all come back to Gamer's Guide to see more videos and more achievement guides and reviews for games. See you next time!